Can you read this abdominal CT? A male in his 50s presents with a few week history of abdominal pain. He comes into his local emergency department and has a post-contrast CT scan of his abdomen and pelvis in a portal venous phase. What does it show? Let's go through the case. There are multiple lymph nodes seen throughout the abdomen. We can see nodes within the left gastric region, retroperitoneum and also within the mesentery. Have a look at these nodes here. The low fluid density within them represents necrosis. The other finding here is that we have a low density lesion within the spleen measuring 3 centimeters. So what is the differential in this case? Multiple lymph nodes should always make you think about lymphoma, particularly pertinent given the lesion within the spleen. Given the necrotic nodes, depending on the clinical situation, clinical correlation advised, we need to consider infection, notably tuberculosis. Could the nodes represent metastatic disease from a primary elsewhere? Absolutely, especially given the necrosis. So this goes third in our differential. Those three make up the main differential, but there are less common causes, and I will just mention you can get low-density lymph nodes with cavitating mesenteric lymph node syndrome, which can be associated with celiac disease, although classically, you get fat fluid levels. There's another sign here that points us towards lymphoma as the primary differential. Here we have the main portal vein and the splenic vein, which on a coronal view resemble a Mercedes-Benz logo joining up to make the SMV. Now if we follow this down and this branch over here, we can see there's large confluent mesenteric nodes anterior and posterior to this, sandwiching the vessel. Confluent nodes surrounding a vessel in the mesentery are known as a sandwich or hamburger sign. This is quite specific for lymphoma, usually non-Hodgkin's involving the mesentery. In this case, the nodes were biopsied by radiologists under ultrasound guidance, proving a diagnosis of non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. So if you see large confluent nodes sandwiching the mesentery, you could well be dealing with lymphoma.